and we're back folks. Last episode, Fall of a Hedgehog, not very impressive, got a lot of stuff done. I will be adding more like time skips as time goes on, but as we say that, Gwen has just leveled up. So, one point available. Um, right now that would be nice to shrug off more damage. Dominance would be good as well. Yeah, let's go with that. I know that uh, Vampire the Rim, uh, Rim, Rim Madness, or whatever it's called for vampires, is considered to be relatively OP in a lot of state, in a lot of instances. Um, but the vampires in Warhammer Fantasy are obscenely nasty. Um, for those of you who have played Warhammer Fantasy, the vampires are not nice. They are like incredibly powerful. Um, if you meet them in the base sort of setting, like in the RP system, um, they literally can just like butcher whole regiments of people. Like in like it's in even on tabletop, um, they are brutally dangerous. Um, brutally dangerous. Okay, so we're getting this put down. My plan is to basically start doing a lot more sort of setup. New ideology. Adopted Sophian Collective as their ideology. Wait, that's... That's... Pink Sovereignty is the Saturn Empire. So what's this? Sophian Collective. The world in the world, every man for himself. Okay. Patrol Mer office began a new family of strangers. So honourable uh, sl sl slave um slave drug using slavers that uses child labour. Okay, this is slightly worrying. Um, man, I didn't expect that to go the way it did. Okay. So we've got like plenty of food. We've wasted actually quite a bit of food, which I'm annoyed about. They're cutting down the trees. We're compacting the packed dirt here to make it more pal to make it more sort of. We don't have to worry about cleaning up or anything. It makes it look more like a castle as well, to be honest. Um, they're digging down that to get iron ore, but we still need granite blocks because I don't think we can build I don't think we can build a basic smithy out of anything besides granite which is problematic I'm going to harvest these berries as well that's all limestone that's wood okay which is a pain because there's no granite structures on the map so we have to research stone cutting. It's going to take us a little bit of time to do. There is granite on the map. We just don't have any um, buildings. So they're cutting down the trees. Our surf is coming along well. And the freemen are basically doing their job. Okay. Law and medicine, yeah, that was to be anticipated. Our medicine situation is pretty bad. Um, we also harvest some. Um, we we'll harvest some basic meds, but we haven't got a ton, from what I recall. Yeah. Yeah, we've got a ton. I will eventually go off. I probably just make my own a sick room up. Um, lime tanks can get hauled out of the way. Okay. So it's it's not looking bad, folks. It's not looking bad at all. Get some proper flooring down. So 
So the keep is looking all right. We've got a bit of a place out here we can do building and various other bits and pieces. Um, just, man, there's so many dead bodies. Um, let's put a deconstruct order on these. Right, we'll, we'll claim them. So we have to destroy them. Okay, that's just annoying. So if we just deconstruct these, what do we get out of the um, skeletal remains? Having a bit of quiet time. I know it looks a bit boring, but to be honest, folks, that's surprisingly how a lot of times it went in the medieval period. Packed earth. Probably could have done something different. I had packed dirt. I could have probably done something a bit more pleasant, like just like grass. Um, but this was a really common um, thing to do, just like pack the earth down stamp on it, give you a compact soil for tra a compact surface for training your troops on. Okay, so what we get when these are broken down? Just bones. That's it. Man, okay. It's not really worth the effort. Um... Okay, so resource-wise, we're low on a lot of things. Um, I'll, I doubt they'll allow us to make primitive arrows out of anything but wood, none. It's going to be just straight up wood, okay. Um, so we're going to chop the wood outside the castle. It will probably cause the spriggans to form, um, which I'm not happy about, but it will just have to be the case. They're finishing cutting up, getting some basic iron ore done, which is fine. Once we get that iron ore done, we'll have something to work with to make some basic tools. Get that guana as well. Yeah, we're starting to have supply issues again. I'm making bulk pemmican. Okay, that's fine. But pemmican is fine. We can store it away from our in areas. Um, people out there harvesting things. Ooh, there's an owl bear on the map. That's worrying. Owl bears are ter terrifying creatures. Okay. So Gwen is almost finished with stones. What happened? Sepsis? How? So it's like we can rise when bodies wants to affect and cause injuries to tissue and organs. Ah. That's actually unfortunate because it's actually pretty good. Um. Uh, we'll use a bit of our medicine on him. He's been bitten by the vampire, probably. Which is not great. Blood loss mage, yeah. Unfortunate. 
stone stacking. Pebbles and chunks. Yeah, okay. So basically allows us to basically do stuff like stacking stones, basically. If I understand the basis of what that did. Um... Exactly, did allow us to do construction spots, construction dry start stack. Okay, so what exactly did it do again? Dry stack. Okay, stack stones for cover or decoration. They look good, but are weak for normal. Okay, yeah. so basically, not a lot. But we can put this down. And with this, we can do stuff like gather granite pebbles. Okay. So it's actually useless. Okay. So we need the rest of the research really done. She's working on stone crushing. Stone cutting is next. Okay, that's fine. That is doable. I suppose what we could do is we could strip out a lot of the inner walls and replace them with wooden ones, which would give us the granite blocks to make the smithy. I'm not massively happy about that, to be honest. Okay, so they're making ammunition. Yeah, that's going to get problematic quick. We need to basically find somewhere. A meteorite just crashed the ground. Sprigger and disrupted. But that wasn't even an us. That was a, a meteorite. Um, okay, so... We have that. You overweight. Oh, well, you got a steel. Oh, he's got a steel gladius. Meals. You don't need the silver. Weight shouldn't be an issue. No, you got plenty of weight. Yeah, why is Brigand being disturbed? And it's a matron as well. Oh man, we're gonna have to send. All because of that meteorite hit. It hit and it's like, oh no, humans have disturbed me. I must go punish them. It's like, but we didn't do anything wrong. Um Fortunately, we have enough things stored away in here. That shouldn't be an issue. Um I don't think iron deteriorates outside, so we can do storage and we can go uh, pallets. We should have enough for some bone pallets, yeah, so we should probably go a couple of bone pallets, get that going. Spriggan is going to be a pain. Matrons are unpleasant. Um, Matrix has been seen many years and are far less understanding of those who trespass the forest's sanctuaries. Tall and stronger than their kin. So it's really going to be. Yeah, it's really going to be us versus them because they'll probably summon animals to help them, which is annoying. Right. With the pallets done, we'll critical clear all. We'll go iron, yeah. Iron ore. 
Yeah, there's two types. But we'll go iron ore and get it out of the deposit. some dried meat as well coming in okay we just need we just need night to come and then we can go and deal with the pain in the ass thing that's now wandering around outside trying to kill us which is annoying um weapons cabinet yeah i should probably put one in here. Um, where do you want to put it? I'll put it the weapons cabinet in here and then we can just stack all the ammunition in it. Unless it won't allow us to do that. It's going to be primitive so let's see if it's Okay, that's not going to do it, is it? Okay. Primitive cement. Yeah, okay. So, fantastically, uh, let's go just weapons for now. Yeah, put the weapons in there out of the way. I know we have a weapon rack. I was hoping that I could... Yeah, weapon rack. Ah, so they probably used the weapon rack. Oh, well. You live and you learn. Uh, put the weapon rack here. And then basically deconstruct that. And storage... Just go, yeah. Clear all. No bio coded. And we'll go, yeah. Bunch of magical stuff. Okay, fine. And there we go. Or then which weapons thoughts. Okay. It's normally supposed to display them side on, make them look really nice. But that seems to be broken. I might actually I don't like the look of that. I am unfortunately going to say. Okay, wait no. Cancel. That's better, I suppose. So he's still wandering about outside, so there's nothing we can do there. Um, can't put firing slots in or anything. How's this person's health? Sparse. Immunity's going up, which is not too bad. How much medicine do we have? That's the question, folks, on everyone's lips. Raw heel root. No one brought it in. Okay. You guys, like, leave when alone. Um, probably shouldn't go in there without her permission. We can't do anything because of the uh, uh Yeah, that is annoying. So I can't I dare not go outside and face that matron without some form of backup. Um because that would just be an absolute murder for us if we do. Put down a basic wooden floor. Mm. 
Okay. Now she's going to be angry. Okay. As soon as Gwen gets up, Gwen can go and deal with her. Come on, then. Big girl, let's go and have you. And an Ibex has joined. Okay, so we will need to basically get into this fight. Because Gwen is going to be having a bit of a hard time. Got hit. How are you looking? Not great. You're hurt, so you need to fall back and heal up. Man, I actually hurt you pretty badly. Your vampiric. You know, feed on the spriggan. Suck the blood of your enemies. Slight bruise. Yeah. It's a fatal amount, so you'll be dead within seconds. That's fine. I did think I set you to self tend, yeah. Tend yourself, please. We can't afford you getting sick now. Okay. At least we killed the matron. Okay, that's fantastic. That's dead. Now we can actually get back to doing some proper work. Right. Yeah, just heal yourself up and you can go to work. Right here. Got a war merchant turning up as well. Another one, eh? Fantastic. Bit annoying to be intruded upon when we're trying to basically do things, but we should be able to do that too much issue. Okay. So please take some of my seeds. That's all fine. Mushroom corn, that's all fine. I don't want anything that's like... Terrible. Um, yeah, take that terrible bow as well, I don't need it. Okay. That's done and out of the way. What do you have for me? That's all fine. Nothing that really actually tickles my fancy, to be honest. I'll probably buy... I'll probably... Hmm. 
Let's get Yeah, let's get ten extra medicine. That's fine. Okay. When is still working on the stone crossing? And I'll be back in a second, folks. One second. I'm back, folks. Okay. So they are converted. Man. And you've got an arcane. Ooh, we've got an arcane trader. That's really good. Okay, so service is going up. They've been converted. We'll try and recruit them to the house. Okay. No, I want to dismiss you. What the? That's terrifying. Then trade with you. Unblinking eye. Ooh, that's cool. Um, yeah, but we can't realistically buy anything. Chronomancer, even all just shadow. Yeah, we can't buy anything. Unfortunately, um, they have some really nice stuff though. She went here. But these guys will. They will take our um, unrefined um, malachite, which is nice. They will also take our uranium, which would be good to get out of the way and give us some money. Um. Ooh, gem of conversion. Very nice. Very nice. But now I have to just take the cash. Right, okay. Also, I need to take this thing out of here because it's making everyone constantly... Um, constantly interrupt people. Yeah, so let's get it stored in here. So they keep on getting the uh, disturbed sleep debuff. Stone smashing is coming along. Still got his orders. Okay, let's get them to just eat that for the time being. They're getting more berry bushes. Matron's getting chopped up, which is fantastic. Got some nice stuff out of that. Not low on medicine. It's just not there, okay. How are they looking health wise? Not bad. I need to put a dumping ground down. Um, for the time being, we'll put it over here. 
until we can get basic concrete. Clear all. And go, yeah, waste. He's picked up that bow of his again. No, I sold it that way, didn't Ants are spreading. Kuratan, chief of Chuzovek, feels the need to send a taunting message. Okay, yeah, fine. Build up your little outpost. Won't do you any good in the long run. They'd really set the locks for this. No. If we do that, they won't be able to get the stuff in. Okay. Right, with that done, we can go back to the meals. There we go. So what is he exactly? So you don't know what he is, but he keeps on getting his orders. That's a crafting spot. Yeah, make heal root. Do it a couple of times. Okay. More visitors. Okay, we're going to have to get rid of the traders. Because they really start to have an impact on... Um, it really starts to have an impact on the... Oh, content. What well, the content on the ban on the frames per second. <laughs> Close by, two people. Don't have any pack animals though, that's what we really need to do a raid. Wait, how much heal do you need? Got enough. Crafting of three, crafting of eight, because you're, you're basically healed up. Get some more medicine done. We'll build another basic wooden cabinet here as well. And we'll go. Um, clear all. And we'll do. Yeah, we'll do medicines. Glitter world medicine and stuff we will never get. Um, like medicine and glitter world stuff shouldn't be in here. It should have been taken out by the mod, to be honest. But it just—it won't turn up. That's the only thing. Okay. Yeah, in here. I'm going to say clear all and we'll go re raw resources, plant matter. Just say that. And. I'll say apothecary stuff as well. Resources, gemstones, that's all fine. Special metals, stone blocks. Yeah. 
And that stuff should be fine. That goes there, that goes there. Okay, so that's good. Right. So what else do we want to construct? Production-wise, um, can't do a lot of things right now. We need to be basically doing stone. Oh, we can do a basic stone cutter spot, I suppose. I'm not happy with it. Um, furniture. Rustic furniture. There we go. Yeah, make it a bone. You have enough. This is super slow. And I just need granite. Yeah. Do it 20 times. We do a s stockpile next to it. Um... Clearo needs to be chunks, granite chunks, critical. This is an old trick. Just drop it on the floor. Or we can, what we can actually probably do. Is go build a copy. Mm. They joined a large Jabberslough. Jabberslough has wandered into the area. Oh. Guess by nature, these rare creatures are extremely dangerous when confronted. Some traders will pay a lot of money for them. Is it a joint? Is it... Man, that's that's terrifying. Okay. Everyone, uh, get home, please. That's a terrifying beastie if I've ever seen one. Drop to the floor. You know, it's dropped to the floor, basically dump it in. Fear all, and we'll say granite blocks. Help wanted. Nearby settlement contact you with special request. No. We're not we're not that kind of that kind of people. Man, that's that's terrifying. It's also suffering from a migraine, which is terrifying as well. How dangerous is this thing? Really terrifying, okay. So... Jabberslough. The Jabberslife. Didn't expect one of those things to wander in, not gonna lie. Um, that is scary as anything. Yeah, I'm going to deconstruct this one. Don't think I need it. 
Uh, sending another message. He's taunting us. The bandits are spreading over there as well. Okay, that's fine. I mean, eventually they'll be problematic, but hopefully we'll have enough vampires in place. Animal trader. Well, that's, um, that's nice. I mean, we could probably have an animal, but we've got a really hungry beastie roaming about outside, which I really, really don't want to mess with. Um, you. Dismiss the, the merchants. But they're with the Empire. So, a couple of dromedaries. I mean, nothing actually really good, to be honest. Um, I'm actually happy to send these guys on their way. Yeah, I dismissed you. There we go. There, those guys are left behind from the other faction, which is worrying because they're wandering about somewhere. How is he looking health wise? Immunity sets is 35%. Dude, just stay away from the giant monster. How hard is that for you to understand? This is going to be a good place to cut it, folks. I've been Quantus Knight. This has been RimWorld Biotech, the Crimson Knight. And we are coming along. Medieval playthroughs tend to be slower than normal playthroughs because you're you're lacking supplies and the well, tech, to be honest. Um, let's just do that. I really don't like the Jabwalk. is just running about outside my base and I can't do anything about it. Sorry, long quest. Something just kicked the game into gear. Mighty building. Build a monument. We'll think about it. Vampires don't bend to other people's demands after all. But let's... If you go up to that... Blasted... Jabberwock again, I am going to lose my mind. They're, oh, they were visitors, were they? Okay, that's fine. That Jabberwock is a mighty bit worrying. Um, we do have supplies of food. Not a ton, but we have pemmican. It's only going to be here for a few more days. Right, but that's enough for now, folks. I've been Cornish Knight. This has been RimWorld Biotech Crimson Knights. Thank you for joining in. And things are tied to coming along, getting stone production going. We've got enough. I think we have enough production to put down a basic... Yeah, we have enough to put down a basic smithy. Um, so that's good, but that's all for the next time, folks. I've been Connor Knight. Goodbye.